Hi, my, my name is Michael Trout, and I want to do a talk that I'm calling the great startup evil, okay? Because ultimately, if I'm encouraging people to do something that have a 99% chance of failure, and I'm not telling them, right, the reality of that failure, then ultimately, I believe that's harm, right? And what we're doing right now in the current startup model is just that, is we're encouraging folks to do things, to do a startup, when in, in every actuality they're going to fail, right? And the reason they're going to fail isn't because of their idea or anything else. It's because of the system. And that's my point here, is that there are companies out there, Startup America, Hoffman, Global Entrepreneur Week, and many, many others who are promoting a failed system. The system, the startup system, is a closed institutional system that is, has tremendous systemic errors, right? And businesses are dying, all right? They die, they fail, right? And people like myself who've been at this for 15 years, right, are now trying to bring attention to the fail system. And what we're trying to do is, is fix that system. And I believe I have the solution because I believe ideas do matter more than teams. And the only reason why I say that is because when I was in college, I had an idea. And the idea was free Shakespeare in the park to bring together the professional theaters in three universities with international actors from England. And the solution was the Southern Shakespeare Festival and Renaissance Fair that I produced myself. And I assembled the board. I assembled, I did all the the, the, I did it all, right? With, and I shouldn't have succeeded. In all reality, if I was saying, hey, I want to do a Shakespeare festival, it should have failed. However, the outcome was 30,000 people attended. And I was one of those point, basically those 0.01% of successes. And for 15 years, that has bugged me. So what I've spent the last year doing is trying to identify the problem and one of the biggest problems is the startup. The startup is a closed institutional vehicle. The reason why teams are important because teams are important to the institution, right? And, and if, unless you have these figures on, you know, on, on your startup, you're going to fail. That's the simple fact. And you've got all these companies promoting this false hope and they're selling this false hope to the American people, to individuals who already have been harmed, all right? And I'm here trying to bring attention to the whole situation and to stop selling false hope and to listen to my solution that I have called the Open Incubator Framework to get behind my solution so that we can have a successful startup America. We can have a successful, you know, um, uh, solution for colleges. And then, you know, and, and, you know, and I met with Global Entrepreneur Week a year ago. And the guy, Jonathan, was nice. And I tried to tell him what you're selling is false hope. And he just had this blank stare and, you know, basically dismissed me and never, you know, followed up. It's, it's a travesty that's going on in America. And what's happening is the false hope we're selling into America is moving to India and China and all over. And if you have a 99% failure rate because you need these angel gate guys on your team in America, then what do you think your chances of success in a country like India or Pakistan or anywhere else? It's, 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 you know, it's horrific. And we have to change that. And that's my whole point here. And the point I'm here blasting the Hoffman and blasting Startup America is I want you guys to listen. I want you guys to call me. I want you guys to, to give due diligence to my solution, which is the Open Incubator Framework, right? I'm writing a book on it. I've been doing this, bootstrapping this with no support from these guys, right? From no support from the from the in crowd, and I believe we can have a thirty to a twenty to thirty percent success rate. You know, I you know I need some funding. I need some help. I need, but we can do it. But but ultimately, the reason why I've decided to take this position is ultimately because by now becoming kind of a hammer versus a Mr. you know nice guy I can actually bring attention to it so you know as they say first they ignore you then they ridicule then they fight you then you win I'm hoping I'm getting close to that thanks my name is Michael Trout